on a real train track, on a real train. So exciting! The movement and that makes you get like really in it and really emotional and it's really, really sad. It's uh, really classy. <laughs> and there's lots of presents on board and everyone's having a lovely time. And then we find out that Carmel was going to snatch Kathleen Angel and they all have a big argument. So all the family have turned against her today. So it's been a very emotional day. How can we ever trust you again? I'll never forgive you for this. It's been really difficult to film being angry at Carmel because I uh, don't like it. <laughs> oh no, that bit's fun. I love playing horrible. I just don't want it to go. Mrs. has always got a soft spot for her, but not this time. Just do us all a favour and jump off his train now. Mercy, that's you... enough! We're building up to all the stunt stuff now. We're in the carriage and have to do all the scenes when we break. It doesn't do a really, really big emergency stop. I think it's because it's an old train, so we're having to fling ourselves forward. We've all just got drenched in fake cocktails, but it's all good fun. And that's a wrap. Hi, I'm Graham Harper. I'm the director of this uh, Hollyoaks episode block. You're going to see this train turned over on its side as it careers up on a ramp here. This locomotive you're looking at now, guess what? The real one looks identical to that. That's a uh, replica that we've made in steel. It is seven tonnes, I believe, and it's going to go up this ramp, which has been designed specially to turn it over it. It is the biggest thing I have ever done in my life, but I've got a lot of support here. There's a huge crew here who are so expert at what they're doing in the effects world. Um, so we're just keeping our fingers crossed. We've got the cameras in the right place, so we capture a fantastic moment. I've just got my dream come true. I'm absolutely thrilled and happy. And that cut, as you will see, with um, all the uh, other shots inside carriages it turns over and all the speed and chaos of action that we've actually created in other areas, it will be sensational. Well, in fact, it, no, it won't be sensational. I hope you think it was sensational. Um, that was a fantastic moment. Morning. So today on the uh, the big stunt is the um, the actual explosion. There's going to be characters in there that are trapped. One of which is Teresa, and Teresa is the one that realizes that the whole thing is going to blow. So as I run past the train, it explodes. And so what I had to do was I had to be my own stunt woman and actually fly through the air. <laughs> We've got the McQueen set over it. I am really pooing my pants about this bit because we're getting fire like blown in our faces. And we're going to set them all on fire. I don't want to do it. Speed. I think that was actual genuine reaction. I got on to Nicole because I was so scared. She was trying to stop me. I was trying to like, get off. <laughs> We're about to be um, blown off the top of the train um, by an explosion. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty damn good actually, I can't wait for it. Oh, I think we're cold actually. We're being cold right yes. now. Yep. Wish us luck. The specific bit is where we realise that Nico, our child, is possibly still on that train. And so we are trying to, or I'm trying to get back on, but uh, Dodge is being a hero. Super Dodge. Super Dodge is back. None of it. Shut up! And this has happened. And all of this. 
so I'm wet and soggy and I feel great. <laughs> I've just found out that actually um, I am going to be involved in the explosion. They're going to have me with the actual real fire crew um, running as soon as the explosion's gone off and everything's on fire. Obviously we're going to have to put that fire out. And they want me to do it. Honestly, when it first went up, my face felt like it was on fire. Are my eyebrows still here? My eyebrows and my eyelashes. 